Near the base of the majestic White Tank Mountains in the West Valley of Metropolitan Phoenix, steps are now being taken to protect one of the desert's most precious resources, water. In the desert, water is scarce, but we need water to sustain our communities and the Southwest lifestyle that we value. Much of the desert's water is located underground, and we've been using this underground water for decades. As a result, the aquifers beneath Phoenix and the surrounding communities are steadily being depleted. The rate at which groundwater is being pumped and groundwater tables are dropping is unsustainable. It is also environmentally unwise. This excess pumping of groundwater impacts plant and animal life and creates subsidence where the ground begins to give way and sink in some locations, creating hazards for wildlife, people, and property. And as the groundwater tables continue to decline, the cost of pumping water rises even higher and the quality of the groundwater gets worse. A new approach to securing water sources is clearly needed. Recognizing the need to reduce reliance on groundwater, West Valley leaders came together to plan how to best use the renewable Central Arizona Project, or CAP, surface water that's available to the area. Leaders work together diligently, sharing data and projections to create a strategic plan which called for reduced pumping of groundwater and a greater use of renewable CAP surface water through the construction of a regional water treatment facility. Arizona American Water took the lead on the strategic plan's conclusions and began work on the White Tanks Regional Water Treatment Facility in 2002. Initial planning and the land purchase were made that year. Construction began in 2007, and the facility began delivering water in November of 2009. Colorado River water delivered to Arizona by CAP is replenished each year by snow and rain that falls high in the Rocky Mountains. The White Tanks Water Treatment Facility uses this water to produce clean, safe, renewable drinking water for residents and businesses in the West Valley. The White Tanks facility treats 3 billion gallons of water each year. That means that each year, 3 billion gallons of groundwater is saved, benefiting us now and for generations to come. This saving is a significant step forward in helping our state reach the important goal of groundwater safe yield by the year 2025. Safe yield is achieved when groundwater is pumped at the same rate at which it is naturally replenished. At the plant, untreated CAP water is initially strained to remove large objects like branches and leaves. Chemicals are added to control algae growth, and the water is stored in two 10 million gallon storage ponds. From there, the water is sent to a dissolved air filtration tank for filtering. Microfine bubbles are released at the bottom of the tank, and a flocculant is added to remove dirt and other suspended solids from the water. As the extremely fine bubbles rise through the tank, the suspended solids stick to the bubbles and float to the top of the tank where they're removed. The floated material gets its reddish color from the iron in the flocculent that's used. This process leaves very clear water at the bottom of the tank, ready for further treatment. This clear water is sent through a second filtering process that uses activated carbon to remove other impurities. After carbon filtering, the water is exposed to high-intensity ultraviolet light that disinfects the water, reducing the need to use chlorine. After it's disinfected, the water is pumped into underground water storage tanks, the last stop in the facility before being delivered to residents and businesses in the West Valley. Water quality is monitored at each step of the treatment process, and system parameters are automatically monitored through a modern, state-of-the-art computer system. Arizona American water experts also routinely test to ensure optimal quality water is being produced. Treating CAP water like this in one regional treatment facility is not only environmentally wise, it's also efficient and results in the delivery of higher quality water to West Valley communities. Currently serving more than 100,000 people in the West Valley, the White Tanks Regional Water Treatment Facility can ultimately be expanded to treat up to 30 billion gallons of water per year, saving even more of our precious groundwater for our children and their children. The White Tanks Regional Water Treatment Facility is not only a good idea for the West Valley today, 
It's a great idea for both the future of the West Valley and the state of Arizona. Reducing our dependence on groundwater is a critical step toward preserving our desert lifestyle now and for generations yet to come. Serving Arizona for over 50 years, Arizona American Water takes its responsibility as environmental stewards seriously. We work to actively address such issues as climate change, biodiversity, and the conservation of natural resources. Environmental stewardship is fundamental to how Arizona American Water operates. Arizona American Water also helps educate residents and businesses in the communities we serve on water conservation, and we provide assistance, tips, and suggestions on how to better reduce water consumption without reducing quality of life. We don't just serve our communities, we're part of our communities. The White Tanks Regional Water Treatment Facility is more than a good idea, it's the right idea. It helps to preserve precious groundwater and protects the environment. It's a key part of a sustainable solution to deliver water to the West Valley today and far into the future.